Hi there, thank you for joining me. I'm Colin from Grosvenor Interiors. Today I want to show you on this video how to apply some of our self-applied stickers. These are to, designed to allow you to brighten up children's wards and other areas where children might be, uh, particularly at the moment where some of our hospitals that we work with are unable to allow our fitters in because of the coronavirus. So we can't necessarily get in to fit the stickers ourselves, but if you're uh, at all capable, if you're used to some arts and crafts with children, then I'm quite sure you'll be able to uh, apply these stickers quite simply. Um, this particular one is Rainbow. In keeping with all of our wall glamour, it meets class zero of the building regs, which means your fire team will be very happy to sit on the walls, as opposed to some of the stickers you can buy on the internet, for instance, where um, they don't meet class zero and can actually be quite dangerous in the event of a fire. In addition, all wall glow material can be cleaned with all proprietary hospital cleaners, so your infection control department should be very happy uh, that you can use them. So I'm just going to take one of the circles here. You can see that there's a series of them. There's eight on this sheet. You don't have to use them all, but obviously you can. And I'm going to place this one in this direction. I'm going to put a little tiny bit of it against the wall and then use my credit card just to smooth the rest of it out against the wall. Um, there are, on this one, fortunately no air bubbles, but occasionally you do get an air bubble. It's not the end of the world. Um, and unless it bothers you, probably better to leave it than try and take it off. On this wall, I can peel them off again very easily, but on your walls, which would most likely be painted, you'll find very often that by peeling them off, it can take the paint away. So it's worth just being a little cautious with them. Then I'm going to overlay this, this piece just to get a little bit of lining up uh, on the stripes. You can see that it's going to turn the rainbow in a direction and in this particular case it's going to hit my sign. So I'm going to avoid doing that by turning it upside down and we live with the fact that the colours don't necessarily meet uh, each other. It, and it's a little bit of poetic license, but I do feel it's actually not that critical. Um, it generates some colour and some motion and activity on the walls for you where they might otherwise be plain or drab. So I'm just going to continue this in much the same vein, and you can see that we can extend this out into a variety of different shapes. It's possible to make a very large arch of this, so if you were just producing an arch, you'd be able to go over the top of a door, for instance. Uh, it might be a playroom, uh, it might be a theatre. Could be any space uh, that previously perhaps children might be anxious to go into. Add the rainbow, add some colour, and perhaps make things a little bit more uh, pleasant for the children. So then once the, the shape is there, as I say, could be any shape, and um, then I'm just going to add a cloud here at the bottom just to terminate the rainbow if you like and then one also here on the right hand side to do much the same thing and there you have it very simple addition of colour in this particular rainbow there are many different ranges that we have of the animal stickers um, they're all quite fun for children and they're all very simple to apply so if you have any queries or questions do give us a call, check on our website. Um, they can be bought via our website directly or just send us an email and we'll be delighted to try and help. Thank you very much for watching. 